Okay, black leather chair that was picked up. Okay, you can see in this area here we got some major damage. You can see that it's actually dry rotted, so we're going to replace some of the foam. And we're going to be replacing the leather on this one arm with some new leather before we go ahead and refinish it. Okay, same thing over here. After looking at this arm, you can see signs of where it's starting to tear and rip away. Okay, so we're going to be replacing that leather also. Okay, the top half has a lot of head oils. We've got a product on here now to lift the oils out. It'll take several applications to get some of the oils out before we go ahead and refinish this chair. Okay, here we are with a leather chair. If you remember from earlier, we had some heavy oils in the head area. Treated that several times. Okay, you can still see we got some white, still pulling out some of the oil. Still got a little more work to do here. Okay, arms were sent out to be uh, refinished. Okay, as soon as they come back, we'll put the armors back on, and then the piece will be ready for color. Okay, here we are with the same black leather chair. Okay, getting ready for some color. Got a first coat on this area here. Okay, as you can see, the head area that we had a lot of oil in the last time, still working on that. Tried to get some color on it. The color's not going on too well have to strip the color back off and get the rest of the oils out before we continue. Hi, here we are with the chair, the leather black chair that we've been working on. Apparently we are having some difficulties with the head, with the head, the back of the headrest because of the oils that it's been on it. Um, we have put another coat of the oil remover, you know, the lifter, um, as you can see, hopefully by this time, I want to try to remove it in another couple hours because it's got to sit so it'll lift the oils up again. Um, I tried to do some oil, um, rubs on the, on the part, but it will not take it. So apparently there's much, much oils on it. Okay, black chair we were restoring earlier. Had some issues with some really bad head oils, which we are still having. Um, as we put the paint on, the oils are still pulling through. Piece is very dry rotted in this area. Okay, um, can go in and patch it, won't last very long. It's this big area right here. Okay, better off replacing this piece of leather instead of going through the trouble of trying to fix something that's uh, unfixable. Hi, here we are with this piece. It's the back of the chair, the headrest, where there were some problems with the leather uh, due to the dryness of it. Uh, it had some oil into it and we tried to remove it. Um, and what happened was that it I dry rotted, it was already dry rotted from the inside and we didn't know. Uh, so we replaced it with a new leather. As you can see, it's, it's a, a white leather which is going to turn black as we go along. This is the first step that we've done uh, on coloring it. It's the first rub, uh, which will be taking more rubs on that and also sprays. Um, as you can see, the other part of the back of the chair it looks fairly well we had no problems with that because there was no oil as you can see it but then as you get here like I said now it's a new leather and it'll look absolutely beautiful when we get done this is the back portion of a stressless recliner um, from West Orange uh, there was some very, very significant oil buildup in the headrest. The headrest has been replaced once. Uh, we have been pulling more and more oil out of there. It actually broke down and stripped the color. And we are now in the process of putting that color back in after stripping the oil. And unfortunately, the color <clears throat> out of uh, the original leather.
Here we are with the stressless. Um, we got all our hand rubs done. Now what we're doing is getting all our detailing, uh, finishing into it. So we're almost completely done with it. We'll get a finishing system on it and get this back to the client. Here we are with the chair. We just brought back to the client. As you see, uh, we have the coloring system back on, all the finishing system on. Here is the ottoman that goes with it. And just want to say thanks for allowing us to do the piece.